G'day, I'm Adam Ford and I'm here with Natasha Vita Moore and we're going to be talking about the H Plus at Hong Kong conference that's coming up this December. Natasha is speaking um, on the Life Expansion Project and its me media and Natasha is a long-time transhumanist, a cultural strategist and designer, an advocate of ethical use of technology and Natasha is now the chairman of the Humanity Plus organization. So. Natasha, would you like to give us a sentence or two about who you are? Thank you. I'm delighted to be here. Thank you for the introduction. My work, um, my practice base and theoretical base work, is fairly involved at this point in human enhancement. I've always been involved in human enhancement, but now I'm, I've become more committed to looking at the emerging and speculative technologies. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Oh, forgive me. My work has been uh, deeply involved in human enhancement for a number of years, but I've, I've begun to take it more seriously in regards to the emerging and speculative technologies because the time has come where there are potentials that were once maybe dreams or fiction or just uh, visionary concepts. When the time is right, it's very important to move on it. So I see the time is right where... Uh, not just the design and the arts and technology and science, but the larger spectrum of transdisciplinarity is looking at what human enhancement is and how these emerging and speculative technologies will affect us. Nice. So um, you're, you're speaking on the Life Expansion Project and its media at the conference. Um, what, what, what will you, can you go into detail about what you'll be speaking about underneath that banner? Yes. I think one of the first and, and most essential elements to discuss with human enhancement is what is life? What is it that we want to enhance? Why are we so involved in this issue of enhancement? Why are we not satisfied with who we are as our biological species? So in, in addressing that question, I take a look at what is life, going back to Aristotle's De Anima, and then taking a look at Lynn Margulay's What is Life? So looking at it from a philosophical, theoretical perspective, and also looking at it from a perspective of evolution and bacteria, what is this formulation of life? So in thinking about human enhancement and what is the goal of human enhancement, in my talk I bring up the issue of life expansion, which means not just enhancing or increasing life as a biological agent in chronological years, but looking at expanding life onto non-biological platforms, such as computational systems and synthetic platforms, artificial platforms. And therein, what is it that we're expanding? Who are you? Who am I? What is this thing of life that we experience right now? Which brings in the issues, uh, the philosophical issues of personal identity and continuation of identity. Nice. Well, that sounds very interesting. I look forward to seeing that. So, um, so why do you think, um, well, what is it about that do you think will uh, attract people? What, 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 what will people be able to take away? Um, and why do you think they should be taking away something from that talk? I think that what people can take away from it is perhaps a new perspective on looking at who they are and their life, why it's something to value so deeply in thinking about extending it and in expanding it, that the issue of death is not um, today considered a finality perhaps, especially amongst theorists, that it can be redefined as partial death, incomplete death, a reversal death where death doesn't have to be the end in time, but can be a regenerative process. And that follows the, the, the directive of regenerative medicine, for example, or the issues of multiple selves in multiple platforms. I think one of the, the central points that the audience will take away from my talk is looking at these emerging and speculative technologies and how they can be used within design and new arts media. Uh, they're not just tools of the geneticists or the, the programmers. They are tools that can be looked at and perhaps used as new media tools, just as artists have used computers or virtuality, for example. Excellent. I'm certainly looking forward to that. So we hope to see you all at the Humanity Plus Summit in Hong Kong, the very first one in Asia, and that's, that's a big thing.
All right, signing I'm out. looking forward to it. I think it will be a, a great success and uh, highly informative and a lot of fun. Yeah, a lot of great speakers. Cheers. <laughs>